Evangeline! Spring is here, Evangeline! Hi, I'm Laura Foy, and I am in Los Station Theater's adaptation of Howard Frank Mosier's novel, Disappearances. Turn your head aside if you're offended. I've never encountered such delicate sensibilities. The writing in the novel is so detailed, and there's so much uh, exciting things, and, and the, the job for the playwright, the job for Kim, was to, to distill all of that into um, a cohesive story that, that still holds true the job that Kim did adapting the spirit of the novel and bringing it to the stage is quite exceptional and not an easy thing to do. Everyone in the cast is incredibly talented and very funny. Um, there's a lot of very sweet and endearing scenes that are almost, almost cartoon-like or comic-like. Um, just reminding me of like old Tintin comic books. Yeah. It's not necessarily a challenge working on a new play. There is a challenge working on French-Canadian accent. That's... <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what, that's, that's hard. Don't pay no attention to him, Bill. He couldn't stand to sit at home and not know what was going on for fear he'd be missing out on something to disapprove of, huh? It's fun, magical, a bit spooky. There's comedy, there's tragedy, um, there's mystery. Uh, it's a little spooky. It's an action adventure, uh, uh, a coming of age story. There's a lot of wonderful actors in it. It's an incredible show that's based in the Northeast Kingdom in 1930s, so Prohibition era. It's a whiskey running adventure with a magical realism undertone. Have you bought another car, k Yes, I have, Brett. There she is. Say, this don't look like our door yard. What I really enjoy about working on Disappearances is making something that hasn't existed before, because it is a new play. It's great because you're sort of crafting uh, the play as you move along. We open this coming week, October 4th, and we're running for three weeks. Uh, if you're in the Montpelier, Vermont area. That whole place was jigging! I ain't seen jigging like that since I said the whole crew of drunk lumbermen of Cody Cook Way to dance so hard, your punk house floor came in! It's the first stage adaptation by your very own Kim Bent. Go check it out.